forget how, how powerful the words are. And we overlook it. And it's amazing, Grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now I'm found. I was blind, but now I see. How true is that for all of us in our, our walk with Christ and just, you know, I was blind before I found him. And now, now I see. I see that his grace is amazing, it's beautiful, and it's something that covers me, covers my sin, his mercy. And I, we forget that. And as Paul said yesterday, we sometimes we get so caught up in our, our Christian life. We're not living like the world. We're not living in it because that would just be too drastic. But we live the Christian life as though it's just something we do and not everything that we do. It's not the center of all that we do and what we focus on. And that is something that I've learned over the past year is that if it's not everything, if it's not the thing you are doing, then it's no different from the world. Um, my walk has, has grown exponentially when I realized that Christ should be the center. He should be the box that I live outside of, not just something I do, not just a box that I pick up every once in a while on Sundays and on Wednesdays and when I play guitar. You know, it's, it's everything that I do, and it's because of him I get to play this guitar. It's because of him I get to go on sins. Because of him, I get to live this life um, that, that honors him. And, and that's something that we should be ever focused on. So when you sing this song, when we lift up this song in worship today, let's remember that he is the source. He is everything that we should be focusing on. He is the amazing grace, and he's what lifted my chains. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Was blind, but now. Chains are cold. I've been 
for its amazing days. One more time, just our voices. Amazing grace.